I mean, there was a man named Maurice Ashley. He was the, one of the first uh, African American grandmasters. He said, "Checkmate comes from Sanskrit. It means it comes from the Sanskrit word checkma, which means the king is dead. That's the goal of the game. So, everything you do has to be focused on finding a way to get an advantage to get to this king. Okay. So now it's your move. What do you do?" Speak up a little louder. Okay, so you move there. Okay. Why did you do that? Because it's, it's square is in a battle. Okay, you're in a battle. Okay, now I'm going to teach you some math. Are you good at math? Yeah. Are you good at math? Just basic addition? Like... Okay. Okay, now watch this. You know the value of the pieces, right? All these squares have value too. This is all real estate. This is land. So the name of the game is you want to actually control land as well. So now when a, when a piece is on the square, it's a half of a point. You got that? Half point. If a piece is guarding that square, then this piece is considered one point. So now what would be the value of that square right there? Plus... So then the value of the square equals what? One half. One and a half. You see that? That's one and a half. What is the value of this square right now? No, because the pawns, this pawn, because remember pawns can attack this way. So this pawn controls that square, right? And this pawn controls that square. So then it's one to one. So if it's, if it's equal, we said that square is equalized. As soon as you do this, the value of this square is what now? One. One and a half. This is one and a half. You see it? This is on the square, and it's defended one time. So this is one and a half to one. So now what you just did is you're starting the attack. Okay, so now, what would you do? Because now, if you take that pawn, what would be the consequence? See, every time you make a move, so he would take you. And okay, you could do that. But now, without moving the pieces, because you got to learn how to move the pieces in your mind. If you take that pawn and he takes back, what could you do next? So what you have to do is you have to erase these pawns in your mind. You have to see this in your mind. You take the pawn, he takes back. What would your queen be looking at? Me dying. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Look at the pieces, okay? Your pawn takes his pawn, right? His pawn takes that pawn. What does it do to the D file? These right here are called files. The D file would be open, and your queen would be looking at his queen, right? So if your queen took his queen, what would he have to do? Right, so if his king takes your queen, what's the one thing that he can't do now? Take my Well, not only that, but he won't be able to castle. Because once he moves the king, you can't castle. Does it make sense? As you go on, you'll begin to see it. So he did this. So what are you, you going to do? You can do whatever you want. I would move my bishops and stuff to okay. attack the king. Okay. Make your next move. It's your move. So you're gonna block it. That's an okay move too. So you're gonna you're gonna you're, you just block the D file. Okay, you just block the D file. When pawns are face to face like that, that's called a ram a ram formation. That means that file is blocked. Which is actually that's another style of play. That's a good move. It's on you. What's your move? I, I attack him. Well, you can't attack the pawn because the pawns only attack sideways. So what are you going to do? What's your move? So, so this, so I move nowhere, like 
Well, you have to move something. But you can't move that pawn. That pawn, yeah, this pawn can't move because the, those pawns are face to face. That's a pawn and a counter pawn. These, those, those are, those are stuck. But now remember, the key to the game is you want to get all these pieces into the game first, and then you start attacking. Okay. So let's say, let's say in Call of Duty, right? If you had a whole squad of soldiers, would you want to send one soldier out by himself, or would you want to send all the soldiers together? Send all the soldiers together. Okay, so in Call of Duty, you want to send everyone together because the more people you have out there, the more machine guns you have, right? It's the same way in chess. Get all your soldiers out first. So what's your next move? I'm going to this one over here. You can do that. That's fine. What's your move? Okay. Now what do you do? No, no. Pawns move forward. They only, but they attack sideways. So what do you do next? Okay. Your move. Okay. What, what square is that on? Should you adjust it? Okay. Your move. Okay. Well, let's 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 go let's go over this real quick. Okay. Now, what's the value of the bishop? How many points? Three points. How many? What's the value of that pawn? One. Okay. Now, if you had three dollars, okay, do you, you get an allowance? Okay. Well, you're probably too young for allowance. But if you had three dollars, <laughs> I said, look, I have a dollar. If I give you my dollar, will you give me your three dollars? Why not? Exactly. So, why would you give him your bishop just to take a pawn? Because if you take here, what can he do? He can take there. So if you won't give me, because I, I think I have a dollar. If I had a dollar, I said, look, I'll give you this if you give me three dollars. You wouldn't do it. You got to think the same way with the chess pieces. You got to think of these pieces as like money. Mm -hmm. Okay, so you don't want to give up three dollars just to get a dollar. It doesn't sound right. If you had, um, what's your favorite Your favorite cookies? Chocolate chip. Chips Ahoy? Okay. If I say, look, I'm going to give you one Chips Ahoy, I'm going to give you one Chips Ahoy, but you give me three back, would you do that? Why not? I have two more. I already have two more to you. I don't need your cookie, right? Same thing with your chess pieces. So what would be a better move? What would be a better move? I can make it's, it's whatever you want to do. Whatever you want to do. Whatever you want to do is what you can do. Okay. Your move. Okay. Now, what, what, what? Where you move? So here's where you got to... Before you, before you jump, you gotta ask yourself the question. What did he just do? He just pushed his pawn, right? So what did that move just do to you? But look at, but look what it does to that knight. Can that pawn take that knight? So he's, he, so he just attacked you. He just, ugh, he just came at you. He's attacking you. 
So here's there's a problem right here. So this is what you got to look at. So what do you do? No, 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 no. That's checkers. That's checkers. <laughs> that's checkers. We don't jump pieces like that. That's checkers. But if you go now, what's what's the point count on this square? He controls that square, right? That means if you go here, what would he do? So then what you just did was what? You gave up three cookies for one cookie. Actually, no, for free. You just you say, here, take all my cookies. You want to give all three cookies away? Okay, so now, where can you put this to protect it? Okay. Now, before you do that, is that square a safe square to go to, or is that a hot square? Is there anyone that's guarding that square? Look at this queen. So, if you go there, what happens? And then you just gave up three cookies again, right? So, where else could you take and put that knight to protect it? Okay, you could, you could go back. But once you get a piece out, you don't want to go backwards, so, or it's right here. So where else could you go? Nope. It's right here. You can go there. Now your knight is safe. Your move, boy. He, he likes moving his pawn. He's going to be a pawn person. Mm-hmm. He's, he's, he's one of those aggressive aggressive. Now, if you notice, see how his pawns are coming down? You don't have any place to really put your pieces, right? So now what are you going to do? Okay, but what happens, look what happens. Is that protected? No. So you want to give your three cookies up again. So this is not a threat yet. So what else could you do? Remember, you want to get all your, get all your pieces out. That's a good move. That's an excellent move. Your turn. Oh, he just, he just wants to rest. Okay. You're moving. Excellent move. Your turn. Who's winning right now? Yeah. How many? What's the score? One, two, zero. Two, zero. Okay. Okay, now if you go to that square, he controls that square. You want to go there? Look what he just did. So now what's the score? Five, Five zero. You're giving up all your cookies now.
four. So now, when he, whoever gets the advantage, they win the exchange. You just gave him a pawn. I mean, you gave him your bishop and got a pawn. So you had three cookies. You gave him two of those cookies away. So you're just you're, you're giving away your pieces now. So now, what's the score? No, no, look at all his pieces. How much is the knight worth? Three. The bishop is worth. Three. And then the pawns are worth. Three. So what's the how many so what's his pieces now? Add, add all his pieces together. Three plus three plus one plus one. Three plus three is six. Plus one is nine. No no. Three plus three is eight. No, three nine. plus three plus three is six. plus one. Plus one. There you go. Now what do you have? So it's eight to one. So he's ahead by how many points? What's eight minus one? If I got eight, so I take away one. Seven. Seven. He's ahead by seven points. Boom, boom. Okay, it's your move. Okay. Um, so what do you do? Um, Bishop, no, no, no. Once you get out like this, the pawns can only move one square. Maneuvering. Excellent. Excellent. All right, what are you going to do? He's coming for you. Nope, you don't get you don't get the pawn. Remember, it's not checkers. But if you go here, you just go here. You don't get that piece. But look where you are. Remember, you did that in the last game. Nope, that's your that's your move. That's your move.
There's no such thing as sweeps. Because you did that in life. There's yeah. the king and the queen next to him, and he had his. He says, "Here's my knight," and so the knight <laughs> sweep the king. Anyway, he says, "Oh, that's it." So he took, he took, so he took all the pieces. Yeah. Didn't work that way. Didn't work that way. <laughs> nice thought. That would be nice. <laughs> but okay, your move. Maybe that's Star Wars chess, but... <laughs> okay. Okay. 